Hi everybody. I hope you're having a great day today. This is, I'm going to say video two of the wireless um, sending designs over wirelessly from PE11. But did you know you can also send that designs from your sewing machine to PE11? Okay. I just want to give you a heads up first that on the machine, categories D and C, you cannot save in the wireless memory, okay? You cannot do it. Even if you were to go in and add a name to one of the designs in D, you cannot save it to your wireless memory. Those have to stay on the machine, all right? But let's say that you wanted to do a quilt label and you had lettering that you either created or you imported from some some place and you wanted to use that lettering on your quilt label okay so you can come let's say we'll come in here and we will do a quilt label we'll pick out this one all right and I'm going to set it and then I'm going to go to memory go to my wireless and now it's there Okay, so I can delete it off of here, all right? And if I go into my wireless, and as you can see, I've been testing out designs to see which ones will work, which ones won't, all right? So there is the design I just did, all right? So now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to come over to my PE11. I'm going to go in to import patterns, okay, from file. It will say folder, then you'll go into your sewing machine. And it'll take a little bit, depending on how much you have in there. That's why I would say at least try and clean it out once a month. Okay, now it's gonna bring up all those patterns. And here is the design that we just did. All right, so I'm going to click on it, and it's going to bring it over here. So now, if I've got special lettering, I can go ahead and type it in there. I can rearrange this, or if I wanted to make it bigger, um, hit the critical clerical key, move it up, make it any size I want, and then go ahead and put my lettering in there. Okay, so... I'm just going to go in here and say, we'll say hello. Hit enter. Change it to a darker color just so that you can see it better. All right. So now I've got my script in there and I'm going to send it back to the machine. So we'll hit send, send to network machine. It's finished and if we look over here it's refreshing okay so I'm gonna scroll down here is my design right here go ahead and click on it and now I can set it and it's ready to go all right so that is actually a really cool feature on here okay especially if you bring something in and Maybe you spelled something wrong and you can't change it on here. You now you have that capability that you can bring it back to PE11, change it there, and then send it back. All right. Okay. Well, that's it for today. I hope this was an informative video. If you could, please like or comment. Um, I greatly appreciate it. And if you'd like to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button for when that next video gets posted. All right, have a great day and happy stitching.